Friend Dave. Mm -hmm. He's a uh, longtime resident in Nantucket. Yes. Part time resident these days. Yeah, but I came in 51. Okay, 1951. Yes. At a DC 3 with John Steinbeck. Is that right? Yeah. You remember that day? Oh, yeah. My brother was so impressed with airplanes that he became doo doo rocket head. Really? Your brother? Hey. That's what the kids call him. He used to draw rockets. That's how he learned how to Your draw. Your brother is the, the infamous uh, Mr. Dubach that does the painting. Marshall, yeah, right Marshall. down here on Federal Street. Famous for Modulate painting. your voice. Did you have a lot of coffee this morning? Yeah. You did, yeah. I'm wound up. Yeah. That's good, though. What's, where are you going off? Where, where are you headed? Donald Duck Land. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, people are going to call me up and... Uh, uh, yeah, say, get rid of that guy. Yeah. Yeah, we no, can't we have can't. his kind here. No, that's not true. Yeah. Now you leave now, don't you? You spend yeah. a lot of your time now. You, even though you're a local, you you find it necessary to go to where it's quiet, <laughs> right? You get a, you get you out of here when it gets busy. You. I've got to have quietness. <laughs> yeah. You, oh, you do, oh, have I got something. Oh, good. To plug. For yes. You. Show me. I just called this guy. Got the book for free. Growing America. He's a it's a modern day Johnny Appleseed, one of my heroes. This guy is the most incredible. David Kidd. Mm -hmm. He's the most incredible guy I've ever read, and this was for free. Why? Because he's a tree hugger. Is that good? <laughs> yeah, what? Email, tree mail. I can go and connect to anybody in the world by touching that tree. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so, so really, what, what is it about the guy, though? The guy is incredible. Yeah. He gave this book to a person that owned the thing said thank you Wendy thanks for your for your help, help David, David Kidd. Kidd oh man that's special then what else do you want to know? well I want to know about the book and we'll uh, he he uh, he was served in Vietnam went two tours yeah he was very poor he thought he could get his education then he went over there and he found out gee I don't want to kill women and children this is wrong yeah. I want to help people and grow trees and now he's writing a new book coming out in September about helping animals. Don't kill the animals. And you feel the same way? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> so now, uh, how long are you sticking around the island for this year? Long, uh, so, da, 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 Did you get know. the cash that you needed before you head out? I, you know something? Yeah. Money's the biggest scam that America or the world has ever known. It will not do a thing for you. The only thing you're going to free yourself is to have simple needs. Simple needs? Yeah. Okay. Is that it? I, you know, what, <laughs> what exactly are you doing? <laughs> I think you got it out, man. I think you got the message out. What, what do you think? A messenger. <laughs>